Now at six, as the world watches the war in Ukraine, students here in the Big Bend are getting a lesson through art about some of the pain felt by Ukrainians through the years. ABC 27's Candace Blake takes us inside the two regimes' experience through the eyes of students. So we're bringing about um, Holocaust and Holodomor awareness. Leon County students gathered at the Florida Capitol for a lesson told through art. The two regimes focus on the life and work of a Ukrainian mother-daughter duo surviving the Holodomor and Holocaust. The Holocaust was the genocide of millions of Jews in World War II. The Holodomor was the starvation of millions of Ukrainians in Soviet Ukraine. Kelly Bowen is the curator for the exhibit. She says that history through art reaches students on a level that they may not otherwise get in a traditional classroom setting. What we have found on this collection is that it does reach students on an um, emotional level. And if you can reach students on an emotional level, you have an opportunity to help create change. I think the artwork is something that, art in general, is something that we use to give sort of an eloquence and um, significance to our own emotions. Childs High School senior Christopher Lee says he feels that the collection paints a more intimate experience and makes the concept of war all the more real. A similar feeling felt by junior Avery Heller. I feel like being here, it makes you feel connected to the people, especially with what's going on currently in Ukraine. Paintings in the collection were discovered outside of Tallahassee in the year 2000. It is considered a salvage Florida resource. Child sophomore Shio Young believes this piece of history serves as a great teaching tool. I think it really is a blessing for us to still have this sense of history and expression from such like a pivotal moment in history. Tallahassee, I'm Candace Blake, ABC 27. And the exhibit is open to the public and will be on display at the Florida Capitol through July 28th.